Hello and good evening. Good evening to one and all. Uh, we've been working on a product review today, so we haven't been vlogging. So no. turning the camera on for the first time. Today, we've still got as guests, by the way. Our lovely guests. And today, I cooked something very special for them. Today, I cooked, I call it scouse. It's basically like a stew. Very nice. It doesn't look as nice as it did, but that's because it's cold now and it's got a bit of a, what do you call it? Skin. Skin you, on it. You it. It's you beautiful. Know. It's beautiful. And we had some lamb with mint in it as well for the non vegan vegetarian weirdo people. And it was beautiful. Did you enjoy your tea? It was alright. Yeah? No, I've had better. Paul, did you yes. enjoy your mince? Yeah? Very nice. Yeah. What did you think of it, Emma? I have a complaint. What? I've got a food coma going on. A food coma? Yeah. Uh, See, that means she enjoyed it. But, you know, when I do cook, which is very rare... And you didn't cook good. tonight, neither, because I what, made it. What was in it? Vegetables and meat. What, which vegetables? Specifically? There was five. Yeah, there were peas. I put, yeah. I put peas in it, and carrots, mm -hmm. and potatoes, and... What type of potatoes did you put in it? White ones, little white ones. Skindle, skindles. Yeah. So, yeah, we all enjoyed uh, the meal I cooked for everyone today. The problem you've got is people have already seen video footage of Neil actually cooking. This ha -ha. It's already all over the internet. Mm, yeah, Oops. whatever, whatever. <laughs> Our viewers know us better, don't they? Are you going to ask me how, what I thought of it? Yeah, go on. It was lovely, thank you, Neil. It was brilliant. <laughs> Absolutely <Okay>. lovely. <laughs> Now, you can blame Neil for this one. I just came to Neil and I said, look, if you have a product sent to you to review, yeah, and it's got, like, a red and a black wire, where can I put the red and white wire to do the review without fitting it to the van? Won't tell you where we said. <laughs> and it's turned into an actual job which is going to be done. What we are having fit is a security camera. Now this is a product sent to us by, I can't remember the name of the company, so I won't even give them a mention. Um, but it's, it's a double camera, a reversing <coughs> camera kit. There it is, FX, FX, that's all we know. A 2.4, you've got your hand over it, look. Digital 720p LCD wireless monitor. That's just the monitor, what's that then? You use a manual. A camera. Yeah, so basically, we've decided we, we don't need the reversing camera, but we do want a camera just above his door. Yeah, we don't need instructions. Thank you, Neil. Keep it professional. Must move to another tent then. It's an awning, not Carry a tent. On. So, what I've decided I'm going to do is put this just above as vent on his fridge, just to Upside the... Upside down, that then. Just to one side of our yeah. door. There you go. Let's be professional. <laughs> and then I'm going to wire it up to the 12 volt system just behind the fridge. Freezer. And then... This I can't wait to see. And then I'm going to stick this right next to my pillow so I can keep an eye on everyone who knocks on his door. I'm going to hook this red and black thing up to a 12 volt system on my light um, stuff. Yeah. Can I tell them what the company is? Yeah. Quickly. S Z F X T. And if you look at it, you will see all the letters in amongst that. S Z F X T dot com. Yeah, if is you look the at it, there are all the Also, Dan has this, this habit we've got onto it now. He uses. I, me, and we. And in Dan's head, I, we, and me spells Neil. We, 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 we figured this out today. But I never said that. Oh, do you know what else? We did. Do you know what else? He needs to explain to them about the wireless screen. The wireless screen. It's a fantastic new technology. <laughs> no. What happened? Go on, get the camera on me and I'll explain. The company said we're sending you a wireless, it even says it on it, wireless camera thingy my bob. So we're gonna wire that up, yeah, with the black and the black and the red thing. 
and now we're going to stick this on wall and then you download an app and it wirelessly gets the picture to there but the company have stupidly sent me a wired version with wires so i've got to wire this up as well so what they basically mean is the signal from the actual camera itself the visual signal is wireless you don't need an app you just connect them both to 12 volt they both talk to each other and therefore you have a picture can you have an app I bet you can have an app, can't you? And I'll never know now. There's no app, believe me. It's the same system we've got in our van, and um, there is no app required. You just need one camera. You can actually connect and one up assistant. to. You can connect up to four cameras to this system, so you can, in theory, have four cameras like we've got on ours. Um, I'll get Dan to leave a link just up there now to the video we don't connect them for. He won't, but we live in hope. I'll cut all that off. <laughs> Right, so we've set the van up for the gang to all relax and have a l wonderful night together. Last night, isn't it, together? Aww. Mm -hmm. um, I am... Um, we... Male. Me, <laughs> I'm going to now fit a security camera. It is a reversing camera, but we're using the security camera feature. Um, aren't we? Oh, I, we, me. So, let's go into the bed. I've prepared all the bedroom. Put that down, just for a minute, till I get past. <laughs> I don't trust you, no. So here is our monitor. Um, we've got some like industrial Velcro we've got on the back of here. If you want this, B&M. B&M? The, the best Velcro you will ever buy in your entire life, this stuff. It's just... Fabulous. Okay. Thank you for the tip. Pleasure. Um, would you like to just press the light on there, Neil? Or should I put this one on? Let's get as much light in here for as audience as we can. That's that's it. No, leave that way. Stop touching. Stop touching. You're doing it on purpose. Stop it. Oh, I give up. So, this is the screen. What the idea is, we'll go on to the camera later on because it's throwing it down outside. We're going to stick the screen up here. Now this is where a little pouch goes, which I've just taken off to make it easier to do. We're going to stick this here, a little hole going through the back there, into the wardrobe, which is then going to go up into this cupboard and be connected to the same place as this 12 volt light. Um, are you up for helping me with this? Yeah, yeah, well, just tell me what you want me to do. Okay, uh, all I want you to do then, Neil, just mount that to the wall, wire it up to the light and then fit the camera? Yeah. Okay. I reckon you have it. No. You want it in the middle? It has to go in the middle. So will, will that interfere with that? No. It can go as low as the actual clasps. The clasps are in the top corner. Are you sure? I'm absolutely positive. So it, a bit further down than that is fine. Yep. There. Something like that, but that isn't level. That's it, so that is where the hall is going. Just there. That's it. <laughs> well built motorhomes, he's only his hammer it all through. So the beauty about Heimers is you don't generally need a drill to put holes through no. anything. You can use a spoon, a <laughs> screwdriver, cup. anything. Mouse uh, is here. Literally just stuck that through, is it MDF? I don't think it's that good. <laughs> Just straight through the wall there, and we've got us hole for the wire to go through. So while Neil is struggling with that for some reason, easy job, easy job. Um, a little, my tip of the day. Can I have your screwdriver then? Because my implement is not good enough and I might need yours to do Yeah, the job sure, with. I'll get you mine. Um, I'll do it for you. You just sit down, I'll do it. I'll do it. Uh, my tip of the day, if you've got rubbish on a campsite, don't leave it outside your van. A uh, lot of foxes around campsites, they will come into your rubbish, make a right mess of the entire campsite and if you don't wake up before the warden, you're going to get kicked off the campsite. If you're up early enough, you might just get away with it, clean it up in time. What? I said nothing. It does happen. Oh, I believe you. 
It does happen, doesn't it? Have yeah. you ever heard of that happening? As Paul. Apparently so. Apparently it does happen, mm. yes. Yeah. To them this morning, yeah, litter bugging all over the campsite because they couldn't bother, be bothered to take the rubbish to the bin last night. So we have the wire through already. Take the Velcro off. Now this is the bit where we're going to probably not agree. Is it straight? Is it not straight? Is it straight? So we will go exactly straight. Don't push it down yet, Neil, and I'll tell you where to go. You want to go more to your right. Uh, touch to your left. To your left. No, not up. To your left. Well, it can't go left because you put on the other deal. Oh, I see. So you've drilled the hole in the wrong place. Um, yeah, that's... Oh, no, that... That end needs to go up a touch. Can you give us a clue on what that end is. Uh, the one with your, thing, your thumb's on. So the left. Your thumb. Which is on the left. Your thumb is only on one part of it. Well, I've got two thumbs. Yeah, the one on the left. Yeah. And it's lifting up slightly. Oh, wow. There. There. That looks level. Oh, no. No, it's not. It needs to come down a bit. Where? The one on the left. Take the left down. Um. Yeah, that might do. I think it'll do. There? Yeah, let's just go with that. Oh, I'm not sure now. Right, I'll set your screws. Oh, it's not looking very straight. No, it'll do, it'll do. I'll fix it later when you've gone. No, you won't. You've got to watch Neil. If you leave just for a second, I caught him going through Mazzy's underwear up here a couple of months ago. And now he's having a go at my underwear. Where? Stop throwing me underwear at me. Stop hanging on him. He's got my pants on his head. Will you stop it? I've got to wear them on my body bits. I am the great Dandino! <laughs> it's Dandini. <laughs> so we've got the wire attached at the back of here going into the wardrobe and we've just found the 12 volt, you see the black and white wires there? So we're going to be able to go through without drilling another hole, we think, through the wardrobe to get to there. And we're just going to link that to probably this, yeah. Do you, do you reckon there, Neil? I'd, I'd probably say so, yeah. Yeah, we'll go with that. We're going to link them to them through here, and then this part of the job's done. So Neil didn't have all the tools he needed to do the jobs I asked him to do. So I've got my trusty toolbox out with all my trusty tools. So the tools we've needed for this job are the snips, the snippers, the snappers, and the snip snips and one screwdriver and the porky Ollie stick that's the one oh he's going for the snip snips i'm not going to be able to sleep tonight because i've just had a vision of me laying there in bed with neil above me like that and i wake up in the middle of the night and that's what i see You'll all be very pleased to hear there's no more product reviews for a while now. This is the last product we've been sent. Um, we have, we think, got a little fridge coming, haven't we? <laughs> yeah. We've got no more product reviews yeah. coming. We've got, we've got <laughs> to get the fridge. Yes, no, we're talking in weeks before we get these next things. But one of these little fridges, which is... it's. We don't know until we get it's it. It's like a 12 volt and a 240 volt, so you can use it on both systems. And it sounds pretty good, so we're looking forward to that. Um, what else? There might be another generator on the way. We don't know if it's there yet. Oh, there's no more reviews coming. Yeah, there's no more reviews. <laughs> there's no more reviews for quite a while now. Uh, we did turn a review down this morning, didn't we, Mazzy? Sweet, you got offered some sweets. Sweets. You know these companies who do... Um, Send you sweets from around the world, all so different it's a countries. Subscription, a subscription based, yeah. Uh, really wanted them, but Mazzy no, said no. No, no, it's just not, it's just no, no. 
I'd rather buy you 10 quid's worth of sweets. Yeah, but they're not going to be from Jamaica or anywhere like that, are they? I like foreign sweets. We have yeah. power. The screen is now working. Well, it's gone off again now. But it did work, didn't it? Can you show them it working? I haven't wired her up, yeah. It just worked. I just saw the screen. Come on. You've been stood there 40 minutes. All the wires are loose. But you must have stuck them sticky things into them bitty bit things because that just went blue. I just saw it and you know it did. He's been... You must have been in here 40 minutes. 40 minutes. All he's got to do is put a red wire to a red wire and a black wire to a black wire and that's that's it. Um, my leg. Finally, finally, finally. Neil, what has happened? It's taken me about two minutes to wind this out. You liar. You've been there about 50 minutes. You, you've made it seem like I've been here for hours. You do realise I'm going to have to cut before and after that slam and turn the volume down now. Do apologise. And again. So, it works. Just press the button so we can see it working. There. There. The screen now comes on. Fantastic. I don't think I'm going to need that hood on top of it, Neil. That sticky outy hood. That's better. We don't need that. Um, we won't show him the dodgy wiring in the back of there. I've told him I'm, I'm, I don't mind that. There's no dodgy wiring on the bit of that. I've just left a piece of wire over the top. Yeah, we did have some... You've done it again. I'm going to have to cut that out now before the bang and after the bang and turn the volume down. Otherwise, I'd, I'd, I'd cut out the whole bit where you're talking and just let them see me put the camera in. That'd be. Dude, your subscribers would love that. And maybe show a bit of Mazzy. In fact, just show all of Mazzy and then look, here's a camera. Done. I think they'd love that. That's a new thing for you. You know, he's putting me down, and I was just going to say, thought, new t-shirts from Urban Van Life, if you thought, want one. He thought I was wearing one of his t-shirts. I did. I was just going to say, though, before you did, ow. Oops, sorry. I was just going to say, new merchandise from Urban Van Life on the Urban Van Life uh, merchandise store. Go over to their channel, check it out. Or, if you don't want one, if you haven't got boobs as big as Neil's, go over to our shop and get one of my t-shirts. Yeah. Let bit flatter one, in the chest. Just get one big boob. It's calling me a nipple, Mazzy. My mum won't like that. So that's the monitor done and the sun is now coming out. Beautiful. So these are the two cameras which come with the system. You have got one which is a reversing camera and one which you can use as like a side camera, which is what we're going to use. Because it's smaller, it's more discreet, and it's just going to go above this light and though it is, I don't know the exact angle, it's at least 180 but it will do the entire circumference of this and the idea is we're going to put a sim card into the monitor and it is going to be recording 24-7 is that right? a sim card? a sim card? no, what am I putting are you making phone calls from the monitor? Okay. A memory card or SIM card, I'll you put fool? A memory card in it. Bloody SIM card. You know I meant memory card, don't you? So I'm gonna put, <laughs> I'm gonna put a memory card into the monitor. It's gonna be recording 24/7. So if anyone comes to this door, we will know who it is. If anyone tries to rip this off, they will be recorded. Um, yeah. So we're taking off the the light, the outside light. We're going to put it above there and just having it coming into here, wiring it up. And we're good to go. Right, the next part of this job is going to be me, Dolly. Attempting to take out four screws on his own. I've sent them on to wash up <laughs> while I do the proper work. So, me... Dolly and Poppy have to, I'm just going to remove this plate so I've got to take this screw off, this screw off and two above there and to get to them I'm going to have to drop the bed down and get the proper toolbox out belonging 
to a proper man. Where have I put it? There it is. Doing a good job, babe. This is why Neil wanted me to do this job. <laughs> There's no way he'd get up here. Don't be mean. I tell you, Neil's been. It's fantastic. hard getting up here. Oh, I've just got two more to get out. Yeah, we're just saying this is going to be great. It's going to give us more peace of mind. Yeah. You know, we have got a camera at the front, front which records 24-7. Yeah. So if anyone ever came to the front of the van or we had a crash at any time, any thieves, any naughty people, we would uh, get them on camera. And now we'll get them from the side as well. So I absolutely recommend anyone to consider it, don't you? Definitely. If, if they're in a position to. You know, people nowadays are targeting motor homes and camper vans for stealing them yeah you want and there's a lot of people out there who hate motor motorists parking on the seaside when they live on the seaside and they're pur purposefully scratching the vans up and stuff so to get them on camera is a good thing <laughs> Got two little helpers. <laughs> There, that can now go back up. You wouldn't believe how much power this takes to go up and down. Does it take a lot? A lot. Does it? If you did that up and down ten times, it would probably flatten your battery. Really? It takes up a lot, yeah. Wow, I didn't know that. <laughs> well, I might have exaggerated a bit, but it takes a lot. All right, so, whoops, I've lost a screw. Ow! I've just stabbed myself with a screw. That plate should come off. There we go. Yeah. Ta da! Ta da! And I'll, yeah, I've done the hard bit. I'm just going to pass you back over to Neil now just to do an easy job behind here with 12 volt a bit. Where is he? He's going to be so proud of me. Neil? Yeah. Oh, right. Um, I've taken that plaque yeah, off yeah. with the screws and got to the 12 volt system thing. Cool. Well done. Well done. See, we can work together. You take the wrong screws out? No. I've done it right. The funny thing is, guys, you remember the uh, Wolfwise company who did the pop up shelter and the beach tent? They actually do these. <laughs> Oh, they did do them. It shows out of stock, so I don't know if they've discontinued them, but they actually do these as well. So we're just looking at the 12 volt system and the light and seeing the best way of doing it. Neil, you're going to have to attach that back. That's dangerous. We can't be walking in and out with that all the time. So when you finish, will you, will you please put that up like that? You can't expect us to walk under that all the time. So we're having trouble finding the 12 volt because all these loose wires were... Well, they're dead. None of them are alive, apparently. So... <laughs> it looks like where's Wally, doesn't he? Um, he's got up on his bed, which I just told you in a video he wouldn't get up there, but he has. I know you can't see him very well. He's, he's there. Yeah, we're trying to find a 12 volt from... That's your screwdriver. Pass you my screwdriver. So we're trying to get, you got a cigarette lighter up in the roof. Why, I don't know. But that's the only live wire we can find. You mean a 12 volt? Cigarette lighter, yeah. Light up thing, yeah. So we're trying to get the cable now from that. Yeah. Down, so we can bring it down and then through the van to connect to the back there um, camera. Yeah. So. That's what I'm trying to do. Yeah. Not going well, but... Two hours he's been up there. And he went silent for over an hour. Yeah. Laying on a bed. I must apologise to all his viewers, I really must. Neil just nearly fell off the ladders. It were hilarious. No one else laughed, but I found it quite funny. Um, but it just, it was only about that high and he just took a step back and he didn't quite fall. 
these gave way, something wrong with them. Um, but he fixed the situation and he didn't fall and hurt himself. But it was funny, it really was funny. Right, so we've just got to connect this in this side now on the camera. Here it is. Fix it up there and we're done, aren't we, Neil? We're just about finished. Yeah. Right, so we're just going to put this wire, we've got a hole through the top of here. The wire has to go through here. Again, I've already done this once, but Neil did it wrong, so we've had to do it again. So I'm going to pull the wire through here. All Neil then has to do is stick the camera up there, because I've wired it all in, look. As you can see, beautiful. Absolutely. In fact, you can hardly tell it's there because of the silver band. It's actually quite discreet as well, so I'm very pleased with where it's going. Will it go like Oh yeah, it will go like that. So your outdoor lights above your doors, some people might be interested in this, it goes in here, press the button here, and it comes on at night, yeah? Do you want to know what it is? It's literally that. Six, six LEDs that cost probably about 12 pence. Tiny little plate. So it w looks worse than it is at the moment. <laughs> uh, we had trouble just finding a 12 volt, but we've got it through. We think it's going to work now. I just need to turn the screen on. If it works, I'm brilliant. If it doesn't, Neil's done a right mess, made a right mess of this. So, Mazzy, if you'd like to come out of the way. Yeah. Or you can be with me. Yeah, I'd like to be with you. Okay, if you want to stand there. Because we need to know where this camera's getting pointed, yeah? Yeah. Turn the screen on. And does it work? Oh, oh. it does. And there's someone there pulling some horrible faces. <laughs> yeah, we don't have that on our channel, you naughty man. So. I think it needs to go up a bit, doesn't it? Well, obviously, it's it's not attached yet. Oh. Well, that's a, it's going to be a nice picture, Mazzy. Yeah. So we now need to choose where we're going to mount it. But the picture, you can't really see through this camera, but it's actually you a very good picture. You've got to flat on, that's it. You've got to remember, it's not attached yet at the other end. We need to mount it yet, but that's looking good. So we started at about 8 o'clock this morning. As you can see, it's getting dark now. It's about 9 o'clock. Um, loving it, absolutely loving it. You've done a great job, Neil. Uh, the only problem we had was finding the 12 volt. It was hard, wasn't it? it w yeah, because the colours in Heimers are ridiculous colours. Yes, because, um, it's, because it's a, it's made out of cheese and cardboard. You can't actually use the body as an earth. So, yeah. So, uh, we've got the camera up. Now, what I'm liking about this, and I didn't know this was going to happen. This is, let's just turn that off, yeah? Uh, this is his camera above as outside light. It comes on all night long um, because that's the infrared kicking in. In the in, Through the daytime, the light won't be on. So whenever we come out at night, we've got a light, which is actually, I would say, better than that light. It's really good. So let's go inside and just check out the monitor. I'm just gonna close this door, Neil. Because it's a bit fisheye fish eye with everything open. So let's just go check it out. It's very dark in here. Let me just put a light on for you. Ooh. Let's have a oh, look at him. He's pulling. Right, he's pulling. He's, what's he doing? He's dancing with. Oh no, Neil. No, there's children watching. What are you doing to me, video? So we've got a brightness here, look. See what I mean? It's a bit fish eye, fish eye here, but I'm not bothered about them. Uh, the picture quality for night time, that is really, really good. It isn't showing up as good as it actually is through the GoPro, but I've got all these buttons to play with as well. Uh, loving it. And if we had the reversing camera on, we could have a split screen and use the other camera as well. But we're not going to be using the other camera in this. Well, is it a review or is it just a fitting? I uh, would like to thank the company for sending it in to us though. Uh, I'll put a link in the description where you can get them from if I can find one. 
because I've been told um, you might not be able to get them in England, in the UK. Um, don't know, I'll have to check that out for you. But very, very happy, buzzing. We now have 24 hour security through pretty much all this side of his van and all the front of the van going right round there. So recording 24 seven. Can't see the gang anymore, but is everyone happy? Happy. Everyone's happy. I'm made up, yeah, I've had a crack at all of these. <laughs> <laughs> He's a good one, isn't he? Thanks for watching, people. Say goodnight, Mazzy. <laughs>